Okay, next topic we are going to learn software deployment through group policy. So now at first I'm going to show you this is our Google Chrome MSI file. Google Chrome MSI right click properties you can see this is the MSI file. MSI dot MSI software deployment we need MSI file not exe. So basically uh, at first we are going to create a OU then user configuration. So active directory users and computers create a OU right click new go to OU suppose IT. I am going to uncheck protect container of accidental deletion. Okay. Now I am going to create a user right click new user suppose man, uh, suppose andy logon name andy dot local click on next password again password Uncheck the two options. User cannot change password. Password never expire. Okay, finish. So we have created a OU that is called IT, and Andy is the member of IT. Okay, now go to this PC, C drive, Google Chrome folder. So right click on Google Chrome. Go to properties, sharing, advanced sharing, share this folder. Catching no files or program from the shared folder are available offline. Permission everyone have read permission. Go to add type domain check names domain users. Okay. Apply. Okay. Apply. Okay. Copy the network path. Right click copy close. So now go to tools, group policy management, explain forest, explain domain, domain name and IT, right? Right click on IT, create a GPO in this domain and link it here. Suppose name software deployment, okay? software deployment okay right click go to edit full screen user configuration go to policies software settings software installation right so now right click on software installation go to properties basic option basic and paste the network path double slash dc slash google chrome okay apply okay right click on blank space go to package install google chrome assign okay it will take some time okay right click on google chrome go to properties deployment Install the application at logon. Apply. OK. Now go to CMD. Type GP update space slash force. Because we need group policy update. For that reason, GP update space slash force is the command to update group policy forcefully. Again. Okay, so now go to Active Directory Users and Computers. Who is, who is the user? The user is Andy. Okay, go to Windows 10 and other user Andy dot local and give the password. 
it will take some time because in backend background it is installing the google chrome software it will take some time because it is installing google chrome in background As you can see, Google Chrome is also available on Andy user. So in this way, we can configure software deployment.